Missouri heads to Florida. And Florida is an 11-point favorite. Of course, latest line over at BetUS. It's 12 p.m. Eastern time on ESPN. Going to pull up the stats here and show you what I got. Uh, I'm almost right there. I mean, I'm almost right on the dot. 10.39 here. Um, And I'll tell you, I'm not sure what to make here. The favorite in this matchup, you know, head-to-head is 5-2 against the spread in the last seven. Missouri 7-3 against the spread in their last 10 games, which I think some people would be surprised about. Uh, but along with that, Florida is 2-6 and six against the spread in their last eight at home. Now, that does include a lot of last year's games in which, man, the Mullen era just fizzled out in such a quick way. It was so ridiculous. But I, I look at this matchup now, and I, I see ways that Florida could absolutely lose this game, right? There are There's ways they could do it. Uh, these two teams are not great as far as PPA margin, which is uh, basically an efficiency metric. How good, how good are you on offense? And defense, um, and not not good for either one of these teams. <laughs> number ninety eight for Florida, number one twelve for Missouri. But what I'm looking at is Missouri's defense, number forty five uh, in defensive PPA per drive. Uh, they're they're pretty good against the pass. They're pretty good against the rush. And this is over the last four games. That includes the game against Kansas State. I, I'm I'm a little bit shocked at this, honestly. Um, their offense is putrid. They can't run the ball. Uh, they can't throw the ball. They did have a little bit of success last week against Georgia, uh, but overall, I just I don't trust I don't trust the players on that team. I don't trust that offense. Um, I'm going to go Florida here. Give me Florida to cover eleven. That's three straight favorites that I'm taking. So we'll we'll see what happens with that. But um, I just don't think that Missouri has a whole lot left in the tank. I mean, a- after such an emotional, uh, just bad loss at Auburn where they just gave the game away multiple times. They came back, they fought hard against Georgia, and they got beat in the closing seconds to the number one team in the country. I I think that I would actually trust Florida to be able to get this done here. I think they're going to be able to run the ball. Um, and, and that's actually the weakest part of Missouri's defense is their run defense. Uh, they're number 32 in success rate. They're number 52 in PPA per rush. I think Anthony Richardson will have some things up his sleeve for this and they'll be able to move the ball on the ground. I like Florida to cover the 11 here. So, I guess uh, go Gators. We'll see. We will see. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app, and make sure to leave a nice five-star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter, at GaryWCE, and the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show.